Oh. Oh. Uh -huh. Hello, everybody, and welcome to Very Little Nightmares. This is the uh, the newest game, of, well, the Little Nightmares universe, and this is a an app game that's out at the moment. Um, it's more of a puzzle game rather than a sort of survival puzzle, uh, I think, or at least I've heard. I have, I really don't know much about this game, so it's going to be very interesting. It's the first time we've ever seen an app game. Oh, okay, from the Little Nightmares universe. There's a new creature. Oh, and we're awake. We're alive. Okay, we have, we have no, hold on two seconds, guys. All right, hello everyone, I'm back again. Sorry, we had a little bit of an error there. Basically, I decided to put my headphones into the iPad, and as soon as I did that, I muted the entire in-game audio. So, I ended up uh, playing through a fair bit. Not all of it, don't worry, just a third. What, what you're going to see today is what, I'm, what I got up to. Um, so basically, <laughs> we're going to do it again, except for this time, uh, I'm going to speedrun it because I know what I'm doing. So, that's good and welcome to little, very little nightmares. So here it's sort of teaching you to um, to be wary of which way you go. See there, if I go that way, it will probably kill me. And on my first time playthrough, I learned this. Uh, also, double tapping means that you can, oh yeah, that's the janitor. Sp put in the, the, the footage, but oh, there you go, of the old one where I, where I unlocked that. <laughs> I guess I'll do that if we ever find another one, uh, which I think I did, I definitely found some. Um, oh god, I forgot about this, I forgot about this, I forgot- ah! <laughs> I completely forgot about that. Oh, there we go. So basically, you want to double tap to run. So there's a walk which you tap once, and then a double tap which is run. Or, I guess, well, it's run or just go. If you're climbing up something, you can't really do anything else. So we are here in a new place which isn't the mall. Spoilers, would you believe? And we're going to learn a little bit something and learn and actually see another monster. So that's going to be interesting. I mean, I say that, it was all in the trailer, This the new creature. And you kind of saw something at the start. Oh, look, a person! And off she goes! It's interesting. I'm excited. I'm excited. Oh, so what I did yesterday, because it's been 24 hours, um, I played. I played this yesterday. Is, is there any reason for me to go across here? No, not just yet. Um, and I was going to edit, and then I found out that I was like, wait a minute. I don't. I didn't do the freak. Ah, oh, the headphone thing. Damn it. <laughs> so instead of getting angry and annoyed, like, oh, I've just wasted all the time. What I did was okay. I'm just gonna go. I'm just gonna go home, and I'm gonna I'm gonna do something else, <laughs> uh, so I can approach this today, fresh and rosy cheeked, and in a good mood. Oh no 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 no! There we go. So you push that. So this game isn't so much a survival horror, as more of a well, I guess it's not a survival. It's like a puzzle horror, wasn't it? Um, this is kind of the same deal, but of course you can't have the same kind of graphics on an, you know, on an app thing, <laughs> on an app game. You can! It just means, right, yeah, you want to tap once, I think. If you're, if you're ever over a pole, um, and you tap more than once, and you run, you might fall off it. It's happened to me once. <laughs> I might just kill myself to show you how it happens. Okay. So, we go down this way, because when I first played this, I, um... Also, the sound, if you just listen to the sound, it's so- like, this isn't made by Tarsius Studios, I think it's Alike? Th I think that's what they're called? Um, but they've got- they've obviously had, um, some input, definitely. Uh, it's definitely- it's Bandai as well. Bandai and, uh, the app game company, I think it's Alike, uh, who have created this, but some of the Little Nightmares has always gotten right is um it's just the sound yeah here if you run over here you die so you've just got to waddle <laughs> so no signs of hunger no but we have seen somebody oh there we are Woo! say bye bye <laughs> oh interesting just gonna knock the toilet roll off go through here 
And there you go. Hopefully, I'll put up the footage of me unlocking this thing without any sound. So, yeah, that is one of the kids from the comic book series. Um, so, we're just going to go down here. If I remember right. Yeah, I'm going to basically speedrun this. So, you guys are going to be super excited. Because there's going to be no... Oh, where do I go? <laughs> up to a point. Actually, for this episode, I'll just get it to where it was before. Um, right, okay. Yeah, I got stuck on this. Like, how do I get up there? I, I if you climb up, you're stuck. But if you open the door... Whoa -ho -ho! Are you ready? Are you ready? <gasps> oh, there it is. The new being. It's a strange creature. I would say you call it the granddad or something. You had, you had the granny. We call him the, the granny. <laughs> oh, dear granny. Off for a go. Right. We're going to free somebody. And they're going to be so thankful. Ah! <laughs> Off they go. I guess we don't need the key because we're not going to unlock anybody else, are we? Right. So here we go. Here we go. We're going to help them. Because now we can open this door. God, everyone for themselves. Right, now explain to me how the heck they got away from this. Because the only way to move this is to do this. Oh, six can now almost outrun a thingy. And there you go, look. Something happened. That same uh, little person, little child, lost all their clothes. So they're running around in the nip. <laughs> Uh, I'm kind of wondering, how do we... Oh, yes. Yes, yes, yes. I remember. I remember. I shouldn't have done that. I did try going down there, but uh, to no no avail. So what we're going to do is we're going to do this. And then we're going to run. Run, 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 Huzzah! We didn't get squished. Yay! Now we can go over here. We go with this one. We pull this one. Gotta wait for it. Gosh darn it, I did it wrong! <laughs> oh, but it did! I almost had it! I got the wrong end of the stick. Oh, I'm so sorry. There we go. There we go. See? I can do things right when I want to. So now we jump on you, go across all of these dead bodies, we think. I think they are. We've, we sort of discovered that, but we're not in the moor, so... We're in a new place now. With the eyes... That turn things to stone! Now, one thing I will say here is that it's not clear that you can hide behind these boxes, because they don't cast a shadow. Uh, obviously, that would have been a little bit tricky for them to do, hence the reason why they haven't done it. Um... But still, it would make things a little bit easier if you could, if it, like, when the light went past it, you just had a shadow that uh, turned, you know, opacity up or what have you. Do we go this way? Gnomes! Follow the gnomes! Gnomes take you to secrets, right? Do they? I can't remember. Is there, is there something over here? Oh. Oh, there is! Oh, I haven't been here! <gasps> New things, guys. New things. I'm guessing we can climb up here. Ooh. Who's gonna be in this one? Let's see. Oh, it's the leeches. Oh Lord, run away. Bad memories. So we, st I don't know yet. And well, I, you know, I, I, this is it. This is as far as I've played really. Um, we don't know if this is before the moor or after. Um, I'm assuming it's before, seeing as Six doesn't have any uh, powers, but that's just me. I don't really know. So we've turned, I don't know what we've done there, we've definitely turned something on. Uh, I don't think we can move this barrel, that's definitely not something we can do. But, however, we can uh, do this. So we get the elevator up. Speedrun Tactics MLG Pro! <laughs> Go on. Go on, Six. Speed run it. No, no, no. The box. Wee there we go. And obviously, we don't need the crowbar anymore because she puts it down. 
I mean, it's, it's the only weapon. No, we couldn't keep that. Definitely not. I should splice in comments from my other, uh, other, like, let's play. <laughs> Close. Ah. Now, this is a trickier one. You'll see why. So I think we can, we're okay here, I think, actually. Maybe here. I don't want to risk it. Oh no, we're okay here. So, we want to run. And then go. Because I don't know. Then there's a reason why we're doing this. Uh, and that's because this eye is constantly keeping an eye, get it? Ooh. <laughs> On this room. So the only way to get past it is to climb. <laughs> oh, we did it! We did it! We did it! Um, wait, how do I do this now? I'm trying to think. Hold on. Oh, yes, I got you. Oh, no! Don't turn to stone six. Go, 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 go! Whoop! <laughs> You see, whatever that, that those eyes do... Now, we thought they were linked to the lady because the power that she has is the same power as the eyes. And um, we never saw multiple eyes activated at once. However, in this place... Um, God, don't step on that thing. <laughs> we don't want to do that. Uh, however, in this place, you do see multiple eyes. Oh, God, careful. There we go, 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 go. Run, run, run! Yes! And this is the creature. Ooh. There's also a fly buzzing around. Bugger off! Bleeding flies! Alright, let's go. So, this, this, this creature is cleaning down what seems to be clothes. Hey, yup. Let's go. Gonna go over. We're going to investigate. Run, 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 run. Yup. And now we're gonna follow it. Because why not? <laughs> oh, this is interesting. I quite like this. So what you do here, you're like, oh, that's the lever. You go get the lever. <gasps> it moves. So how'd you do it? Ooh. Well, because James is a clever bugger and because he's already played this. He knows exactly what to do. <laughs> I remember just when I first played this, I was like, oh, well, I need that thing. I've seen that before. It's obviously a crank, but I didn't know where it was, where to put it in. And then until I saw the little triangle here. Yeah. Bad gnome. They're not friend. I'm clicking. Go on, crank it. Yeah. There we go. You're seeing an ultimate speed run of this game. Oh, yes, yes, this one. This one was a tricky, tricky one to work out. Um, now if I remember right, let's see, let's see. How do I do this? I'm trying to remember. Ha, huh, here we go, okay. Let's see if I can do this without messing it up. This is an interesting puzzle. So I've got to go across here. Go across here. Don't know what these things are supposed to are, are these washes? It's like a tumble dryer. So you push that down, because there's a little, uh, like, a pressure sensor button that opens this door. But we need something to go on it, because as soon as we step off it, which I'll show you right now. hi -ya! And it closes! Fantastic. So now, 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 we need to, uh, get the cross here. But the thing is, if you have... If you roll it across, it just goes all the way to the end. And it can't fall off the edge because it's too... This is like a little lip on that thing. So what you've got to do... What I figured out, actually, is when you rotate this here... Ha ha! There we go! And now we can go... Slip! And then we turn it a few more times. No, no, no. No, no. This way. Come on, Six. You're clever. You can do this. It's a very good feat they've managed to, like, make a Little Nightmares game. Uh, with touch controls and you know what it's executed quite well <laughs> oh there's a thing 
I just realized there's a secret up there. Oh, hold on, guys. Oh, well, well, I'll tell you what. I'll get the barrel down first. There you go. And then we'll, then we'll push it. Whoa, the strength of a tiger. <laughs> Bam. Okay, so before we go in there, I'm going to go and get the secret. It does, however, seem that all of these collectibles are just characters we already know, but you never know. We might get something new. Oh, yeah, I've already been here. Roll the footage of me being here and surprising the thing. whoop -a! It's the ferryman. And the, uh, the character from the comics that seems to recruit all of the children to bring them to the mall. So, a lot of lore behind that. And now we're going to go into here. Yes. Now, this is interesting. This is... Yeah, there it is. I say it. It could be he. Nobody knows. Now, obviously, we need to get to the bookshelf at the top. But... He's gonna see us when we run past. And he's also cleaning the clothes. You can see some washing liquid up there. So this is what you gotta do. You gotta be cool. You gotta be cool and collect. It's kind of a part of me that wants to die just to show you what happens. All he does is run you over. There you go. <laughs> so we gotta go here. Woo! Can't get me! Ha ha ha! And he's gonna come round. Oh no, 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 no! He's being clever! There we go. There we go. Woohoo! On the run! I <laughs> like how he's to bash into it. Please run. Keep going. Keep going. Keep going. Climb, 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 climb. Climb, 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 climb! <laughs> yes. Oh, up, 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 up. Run, 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 run. I think we should be okay just staying here. <laughs> Damn it! <laughs> run, run, run. You see, he's a trigger. He only comes in when you go on the thing, just to scare you. And I think he deliberately comes to wherever you are. Let's have a check. He bloody well does. No! God damn it! <laughs> oh, it's so hard. Okay, okay. Wow, I don't remember dying so many times. Okay, so we're gonna go over here. <gasps> Easy does it. Haha! <laughs> Can't get me! There. <laughs> He got bored, in other words. And look at what we have in this room. Hair. Hmm. Now, is he, are they using the clothes to make the hair? And even, things are going to get weirder in here. You have leathering? I think it's called, is it tanning? I think it's called tanning. So tanning is the process of taking skin, like cow skin, any kind of skin, and drying it out to make leather. And it seems like these might... I mean, these are little bits of skin. These are not big bits of skin. And they seem to possibly be children, I'm assuming? So is this what we, they use the children for here? To skin them alive. Okay, come on, gnome. I need to free you. I actually spent ages on this one, so you'll be very glad that I managed... That I'm just going to speedrun this. <laughs> Hey, yup. This bit kind of reminds me of, um, I think it was in the residence where there's a rocking trolley or something with gnomes in it. So it was, like, you have to pull it to a certain bit. Oh, it's just so infuriating <laughs> when it's, like, rocking backwards and forwards. Okay, no secrets. Keep an eye on any cracks, guys. If you see any secrets, I've definitely missed a few. I think I might have missed one in here. 
See, there's eyes. There's eyes everywhere. And now we can get over here. So there's a lot of mannequins. Oh, hello. Oh, yeah, that's right. I forgot about that. So I was like, is that a plug? What is that? <laughs> can we go in here? We can go up here now. We can go across and fall down and push the thing out. Woohoo! That took me about 15 minutes last time <laughs> to work out. Ah. Uh, for hindsight, it's a magical thing. Or just being able to play it in the future. There we go. And now we can do this. Come on! Right. Okay. Now this is really tricky because I didn't even see that this was a little... Oh, hold on. Is there a thing there? Is there a crack? Oh, there is! Ooh. Oh, that's cool. So we... Oh, this has got to be some relevance, because we know the gnomes are children. And that de they've definitely been cutting out- are they cutting out- are they making friends? Like, people who they were, uh, prisoned with? Other children? Possibly. Well, let's see who it is. Oh my god, it's one of the guests! Oh. Alright. We'll need to see if you get any facts with that. That'll be interesting. So the, gnome, so the gnomes do run to a little hidey hole. So I, I probably have missed one. Right, and this got me for ages. So I was like, where do I go? And then and then the whole, then like, it, not even the pipe lights up. <laughs> up the pipe we go. Ascending to the heavens. And time to run. <laughs> Bam. Should have broken the floor. Also those cracks on the tiles, you can fall and die through those. So we've got a shoe and a torch. As well as a big wrap. Not too sure what that is. Probably a body. This is the Little Nightmares universe. And there it is! That's where we are! That painting! I, I can't remember what it's called. It's like the residence, but I know that's the DLC. And off we go. Taken. <gasps> Down the elevator. And he just leaves us here, apparently. That, that, that's completely fine. Yeah, just leave us. It's all right. <laughs> okay, guys. I'm going to leave it here because this is where I got up to last time. Except for I think I've shaved off 10 minutes of, um, of my last playthrough. So here on out, uh, I won't make the same mistake. Um, and it should be okay. And until next time, enjoy this video, guys. Leave a like if you're hyped to find out more secrets of the Little Nightmares universe. I'll see you later. Bye-bye.